Hey guys, Brian with House to Homestead here today. So I just have to show you, this is the coolest thing. Um, these are beeswax wraps and it replaces plastic wrap. Um, so let me grab a bowl and I'll show you what I'm talking about. <clears throat> let me use this one. So this, obviously this one's too big and I need to do some that are circle sized, but this is just 100% cotton. Um, dipped in beeswax um, and then you can use that you, you use the warmth of your hand to mold which this one's just not the right size for this one it's just way too big but you can use the warmth of your hand and that's what what you cover with a bowl with so I'm just going to do a quick video. I am, I'm going to go ahead and stick these. These are just beeswax beads that I had bought off of Amazon. And I'm just going to stick them in the oven real quick to melt. You aren't trying to like cook them. You just want to heat them in the oven just long enough to bake. Or not bake, but melt so it's, it's a liquid. So I'm going to do that. It'll just take maybe three or four minutes. And I'll bring you back as soon as I'm done. So it doesn't take very much. I just sprinkled a little bit and then you have to work quickly because this will start to harden pretty fast. So you just want to go through and and you can see where the wax is soaked in so that makes it really easy to tell that you've got all the edges. It does. It is a little warm. It's not going to really burn you but I just laid down some parchment paper because when I go to hang it up, it's going to drip. I'll show you what I'm <clears throat> I've got it hooked on sometimes there is a little bit of extra and I probably should have used um, like those pinking shears to get a nice clean edge that won't fray but I saw this and I had been wanting to do it and I've been working the last couple days so I haven't had a chance to but This is the coolest thing and the best part is is that you can eliminate plastic wrap out of your I mean that's the whole purpose is to replace the plastic wrap with something natural but because um beeswax has antibacterial properties your food is going to be fine it's not going to go bad this one I got a little bit too thick But I could probably just iron this, like, under a paper towel or something, just to smooth out this wax. And I might do that just so it has a nice, smooth finish. But it dry dries really, really fast. <clears throat> so you can see I got a little bit too much right here. It hardens quick. That's the thing. You've got to work really fast in order for this to not harden on you so I'm gonna grab one of these other bowls so see it's already totally hardened and that was maybe three minutes so that's the key is just working really fast so now that I've got two hands I'm just gonna show you this one's um, more of the right size for this bowl, but you just use the warmth of your hand to, to mold it around whatever it is you're using. So it does create a, good, a pretty good seal. Um, 
really, really cool concept. So, and you can see, you know, where you've missed wax, but I, I'll probably just, like I said, iron over these just to give them a nice smooth finish and call it good. So, <laughs> I, it's messy, guys. It's, it's a pretty messy thing, but it just peels off really easy. And you can, I mean, you can use, I mean, you can do circles, you can use or make any shape that you want. So I just love this and I wanted to share it with you. So anyways, I just want to do this real quick video. I just love this so much and I really hope that some of you will give it a try. It just, just doesn't get any more simple than that. So, and talk about all natural. So anyways, just really quick video. I um, just wanted to show you how you can make these two and... I'll catch you next time. Bye.